Hello beautiful souls, welcome to my channel. This is your favorite fortune teller divine light and today I'm going to do a coffee cup reading for this upcoming week and we're going to check to see what's coming your way in the financially, in love and career, friendship and more, okay? At the end of your reading, I'm going to pull some cards that get some clarity into a situation in your mind. If you would like to see that one, you can just stay till the end and check to see what's going to be coming up for you, okay? Let's open your cup and see what's happening. Okay. All right. Let me focus. Okay. I see someone is holding a bow and arrow here. You can see there's a, like a male figure here. And um, I don't really have my pointing little tiny things today. I'm going to show it with my hand. You can see there's a male figure. He has a bow and arrow. And there's somebody at the end of this arrow here. A uh, bow and arrow indicates um, a warrior character. It can be a Sagittarius, a fire sign, or also someone who's prepared for the battle. There's also another bow and arrow right in front of this person. So this can be a competitive situation that you're going to be actually um, falling in in the beginning of the week. There is somebody here in front of this person and maybe there's even like a child here. This can be like a family matter that you're trying to resolve with a family member. Also, this can be like an environment, like family, like a very close friends or maybe like in a company that you're like family. And also this person is like in, in someone is in the middle trying to stop this thing, tr stop this um, battle. I see women here might have like letter V in her first name or last name, she's actually launching forward. She's actually encouraging the war, but this is maybe you ask just, and you have somebody else behind you and trying to stop this happening. This can also be something that you are planning to do, maybe launch forward to take some action about something that you're truly desiring to have in your life. And somebody might be trying to block your path also. This can be interpreted in that sense as well. There's a male figure behind you. This is like the thinking man. This looks like the thinking man. Um, you know that um, there's a sculpture. There's this guy actually like sitting and thinking he looks like, I think it's like a Greece. I'm not really sure, but it looks maybe Roman because I don't know if there's like any Greek sculptures left today, but it's a Roman sculpture, I think. This guy is right here and it's telling me like, you're going to have like a moment of contemplation during this week. Um, you're not going to start the war. You're not going to take the action. You're just going to be prepared for it though. You're going to get ready for it and you're going to be having some ideas coming. I see the number one here it means new beginnings, actually leadership, courage and being independent. And uh, this can be maybe not taking action will open the doors for independence for you. Another better idea, another better opportunity will be presenting itself to you when you don't take any action in the bottom of your heart. I see you're opening your arms and welcoming something new coming into your life. This is actually number one can be the new beginning that is actually starting. I see um, glasses here. Uh, this can be towards the end of the weekend, something that maybe you're going to be going to go into a museum to do something intellectual, to actually expand your vision or maybe research something. But I feel like this is going to be some uh, like, um, intellectual activity that you're going to be doing, which will give you a different perspective with the glasses. I see someone here reaching out to you. There's a woman here. She's wearing a hat, like she's holding up a torch in her hand. Sagittarius, we said with the arrow can be a fire sign. This woman actually has like a key with a heart shaped handle. And in the end of the key, there is actually the, the here, um, uh, and there's a turtle face here. This can be someone who wants to buy a house. This can be you maybe wanting to buy a house. And the idea of what kind of what, what you want is shaping right now. And you're on the tail though. There's another person attached to this woman. And there, this looks like a woman, like a feminine energy also. You guys are going to be maybe like a sister 
or a close friend, there's actually a lamp, a magic lamp in between. So this magic lamp is attached to this other person. This doesn't have to be another person, by the way. This can be your the genie coming out of the, the magic lamp to make your desires come true. So if you have like a desire about like a property, buying something new or maybe a new start, a door of your own can be a new car, can be a new office, can be a new um, house. The idea is there the plans are not clear so make sure everything is all set because the turtle is telling me like turtles because they carry their houses on their back this can be a house thing also because they are actually slow movers and that means that you need to it's good to have uh, like uh, put some thought into the things like just think it through okay I see right here, there's a male figure, like I said, opening his hand. Now I can see the, his arms. I'm wearing like a cloak, maybe. I see he has like a um, goat here. Yeah, this can be a Capricorn male. And wearing a cloak can be a lawyer or like a, someone who's actually wearing capes. Um, like the... As uniforms, like we can put it like that. Like someone who wears uniforms and uh, we'll be giving you guidance. I keep saying lawyers because like in where I'm living, usually lawyers wear capes and judges wear capes and um, uh, doctors and um, I think chemists and the people working in labs and stuff, they wear capes, like they wear like a uh, coat. And uh, that's why I keep giving that example. But if you're living somewhere else that other um professionals do have that kind of uniforms you can reinterpret that to like what however it applies to your situation i see towards the end of the week there's a smiley face here so you're smiling you're calming you're getting calm and somebody's actually hushing the sound this can be like a meditation session that you're going to be having number four is visible stability putting your roots down creating a strong foundation is actually coming your way and maybe this hushing can can be uh, your inner self actually helping you get rid of like if you're feeling anxiety in your situation helping you to like calm down okay get to like a calm point in your like in yourself okay i see here there are two people there's look like looks like a child and a mother here this also looks like a dog like maybe like a wolf came to my mind with the red riding hood red riding hood or red riding hood i'm not sure uh, and the wolf is showing here so uh this can be and there are so many dogs here this can be someone actually looking like uh, someone loyal but not really showing their face there's going to be like an understanding happening for you there's going to be an enlightenment coming for you okay this week and this will change your perspective in a lot of things and also brings a lot of rest and relaxation this even looks like um you see you're on the beach calming this looks like a calming beach and the mountains are behind you so there's going to be like a relaxation moment happening for you this week okay i see a chunk of money just fell out of your cup here so this indicates some money also going to be showing up for you yeah that's going to be coming really fast though it seems like it's going to be delivered to you really fast this can be like um something unexpected the fast of it is actually look like something unexpected i see there are two desires i don't know if i ask you a question if you have a desire a question an intention hold it in your mind and let's see what the answer is going to be for that okay and like when i flipped it i saw like there are two desires the third one is coming right here the third thing maybe the first thing that you actually asked for this two were the things that you were actually having in your mind there's a person holding up a guitar you can see here there's a woman standing here. This can be a musician in your uh, life or something artistic that you want to do will be getting clarification or maybe getting an opportunity. The first thing I think like the thing that you're asking is actually whatever it is, it's it's coming in due time. It's not like it's not going to be delayed. It's going to be coming very fast also, okay? Let me see. There's a heart shape in your, like, where your heart space is. And, like, your kismets are actually falling out of your cup, which indicates, like, you're going to have, you're going to receive, and you're going to be able to give. I see a letter T in your uh, in your cup right here. This can be in someone's first name or the last name. This can also be, like, a snake climbing up. Can be represented for your kundalini energy. I see a woman here sitting down with, like, a bob cut. 
and she has like this book in her hand and she has like a mentor actually guiding her this can be like if you're a male watching this you can be the mentor of like this women maybe guiding her or she's asking for your guidance and you're helping her out or this is you if you're a woman maybe this, you're going to be receiving some mentorship and um this can be something you're desiring to have um or this this is something divine that divinely guided thing okay it doesn't have to be initially coming as like a form of a person showing up and telling you what to do this can be like a divine guidance uh, that um a person or like a message coming through which will give you a hint maybe even open the doors for you to um um, to manifest your heart's desire whatever that desire that you had initially okay let's see if any of you manifesting love for sure that's showing this is the cancer pisces scorpio the water energy this can be a water sign or someone who's romantic overall romantic flirtatious intro introspective fickle falling in love being swept off your feet a sudden love affair a lack of balance in relationships, situations, or topics that make your heart flutter. A love of art and poetry. I don't know about the love of art or poetry, but I see here someone might come up to you with a love offer. Uh, this can be because it's a masculine figure. I'm not going to say this is a male or female. I'm just going to say the person is going to be taking the action towards you. Okay? doesn't matter. The gender doesn't matter. And this is going to be a perfect couple. And uh, you're going to be making an offer to them as well. Okay? So this is going to be a very balanced, beautiful relationship. Loving, compassionate, psychic, self-sacrificing, queen of cups, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio as well. Doesn't have to be though. It can be like your Venus sign also. Self-sacrificing, deep psychic insights, caring for others but forgetting to take care of yourself. This can be a point that you should be taking care of this week. Maybe focusing on specifically this week. Trust your intuition, a deep love of family, friends, and follow your heart, Okay. So like there is love showing or this can be something, maybe a business opportunity, maybe a job opportunity that is going to be like, they're going to want you and you're going to want them. And this is going to be giving you a lot of like emotional satisfaction at the end of the day. Okay, let us see what else we have here. Oopsie. The cards are falling out. Let me see what's coming for the beautiful souls this week. Spirit. The dreamer, we have a beautiful new beginning, a new start, trust yourself, push your fears aside and take a leap of faith. For sure, something good is going to show up for you and something that will actually give you a lot of pleasure will be coming. I also have the starlight. Last week I pulled from these cards, but I want to pull one again. So Libra energy, the dreamer, a new beginning, a new relationship or like a new offer in the workplace. Can you be like an upgrade in your situation? Maybe you're working in a position for a long time and you are actually now capable of doing more and you're showing that off and that will be uh, appreciated, okay, by the others and uh, whoever actually uh, taking care of the things. We have a new horizons here. Old ways won't open new doors so if even if you're not really thinking moving forward there's going to be a push coming so this is telling you there's a map in front of you and you know how to find your path and um, maybe you need to start experimenting new things this can be applied to relationships friendships even the job opportunities that is coming your way maybe updating your resume or talking to different people and get some uh, you know more information and i also have on the bottom here light Without the dark, we would never see the stars. The stars right here indicates your wish fulfillment. And if you're going through the dark time right now, the actually there's a transformation opening behind the scenes. And this will bring you the light that you're desiring to have. You're going to see the new horizons very soon, okay? All right, my beautifuls, that's all for today. Hope you like this reading. If you do, don't forget to give this one a thumbs up. If you want to see more of these, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. I wish you all a magical day. Bye.